Tropical Storm Greg 2023 Last Modified, 3 o'clock August 17, 2023 UTC Deep Convection Surrounding Greg continues to pulse under the influence of southeasterly vertical wind shear. This has displaced much of the convection to the north of a partially exposed low-level circulation center. Dvorak current intensity estimates range from 2.0 slash 30 knots by SAB, to 3.5 slash 35 knots out of JTWC, to 3.0 slash 45 knots at HFO. Since a 2343 UTC Simsitkan came in at 50 miles per hour, 43 knots, and some's ADT was recently holding as high as 45 miles per hour, 37 knots. A blend of the inputs supports keeping the official intensity at 45 miles per hour, 40 knots, for this advisory, though that may be generous. Greg remains on a relatively steady forward motion that is slightly north of due west, 280/11 knots. A low to mid-level ridge far to the north will keep the tropical cyclone moving along a general westward track through Thursday night causing Greg to pass well south of Hawaii. A turn toward the west-southwest is forecast on Friday as the weakening tropical cyclone is steered by a deepening ridge to the north. The official forecast track was altered little from the prior advisory and lies near TVCE in the middle of a tightly clustered guidance envelope. Relatively light, southerly vertical wind shear will likely produce only slow weakening of Greg over the next day or so. Beyond 24 hours, the dynamical guidance suggests steady weakening, likely due to a gradual increase in northerly vertical wind shear produced by a strengthening ridge aloft to the north. Conversely, the statistical guidance shows little short-term change in Greg, followed by some strengthening. Given the tropical cyclone's inability to strengthen within the current shear environment and sufficiently warm sea surface temperatures, the official forecast follows the steady weakening trend of the dynamical guidance beyond 24 hours, and Greg is expected to become a post-tropical remnant low by late Friday or